Hello and welcome to the northeast of England. We're here at St James's Park. I'm Derek Ray and I'm joined here on the gantry for commentary by Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Newcastle United versus Arsenal. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Just the challenge that was required. Here are the starters for Arsenal. Aaron Ramsdale as the goalkeeper. Granit Xhaka plays alongside Thomas Partey in the centre of midfield. And leading the line today is Gabriel Jesus. Keeping the ball moving. Oh, good defending to stop a decent looking attack. And support available. Can he put them in front? Well, he stumped it out of there without much fuss. Well, he really is danger personified, but in this game, Stuart, what do you think we might see from him? Well, Derek, he's a great all-round player, but it's his ability to run in behind defenders that makes him such a threat. And when he gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper, he usually scores. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. Well, he has the measure of his man. Might take the lead. Able to clear the danger, at least for now. Pressing high, and they have the ball again. Might it be Gabriel Jesus? And there it is, 1-0. The efforts have been rewarded. And look at the celebrations. Well, here it is again, and it's really poor defending. They just don't show enough urgency to get tight or make a block, which is why the ball's ended up in the back of their net. So the action continues, and it's up to the Magpies to wipe out that last goal. Sven Botman. Botman. It's neat passing, confidence on the ball. Well, they were very patient, but they no longer have the ball. Callum Wilson. Long staff, and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. As you can see, Arsenal are seeing less of the ball, but when they have won it back in midfield areas, their counter-attacking has been excellent. They'll be happy with the way the game's going at the moment. And the threat on the counter-attack is very real. Here they come again. Chance to finish. Absolutely spot on with that challenge. Well, he needs to be careful here. Out of play, and an Arsenal throw-in forthcoming. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Gabriel Jesus! And the post denied him. Dan Byrne. Oh. 
So as we approach the interval, Newcastle behind in this one, chasing the game. Stuart, what have you made of their performance so far? Well, they've not had quite enough purpose to their attacking play so far. It's all been a bit too predictable. But in the second half... Oh, Stuart, they must score! And they've done it to square the game once again. Exhilarating. Well, just look how he holds off the defender. He keeps his balance and he still hits the target. What a good goal that is. So back underway, they've levelled it at 1-1 here. Wilson. Well, he went strongly into the challenge and the result is a throw-in. Thomas Partey. Martinelli. And return to Jesus. Martinelli. And here's Xhaka to jump in front. And a goal to re-establish their advantage. Just look at the celebrations. Well, it's great awareness of space in the box. And then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. Well, we're at the halfway mark here at St. James's Park. Well, a star shining brightly in the... Arsenal with the lead going into this second half, but no room for complacency. Using his strength to shield the ball. The Magpies pushing forward with options available. Trippier. Well, he read that brilliantly at the back. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Gabriel Jesus. Joel Linton. Possession and patience, the watchwords. Well, as you can see, Newcastle have had most of the ball, but it means nothing unless they start to be more creative, particularly in the wide areas. Up to this point, they've been too easy to defend against. That's right, and priority number one here is to win the ball back. Xhaka. Here's Gabriel Jesus. Is it going to be Granit Xhaka? And intercepted it. 30 minutes to go then. Callum Wilson. Long stuff. It's with Joe Linton. And the Magpies moving the ball forward with purpose. Joel Linton. And it's with Isaac. Could be. Oh, terrific save from the keeper. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? They decided that now is the time to go to the bench.
They take it short. Trippier. On to Wilson. Jacka with it. And into the last 20 minutes. Fabian Scher. Here's Isaac. Well, he's given it away. A very effective clearance. Joel Linton. And it's with Isaac. It might be. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. Granit Xhaka. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? A disappointing end to the move. Well, if these Newcastle players aren't inspired now, they never will be. Their fans have been absolutely brilliant. Beautifully disguised ball. Did look as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. It needs an accurate cross. And it's with Isaac. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Jorginho. Jacker with it. And a creative look about this. Partey. And back with Xhaka. Using his physical strength to shield it. Long stuff. Well, totaling up all the stoppages, we'll have two additional minutes. And into an attacking position, it's not too late for them. Wilson. This could level it. Really sound defending. Well, they can bring it out now. And the referee blows the whistle. That will be all for this game. And no points picked up by Newcastle United. What did you think of it all? Well, Derek, it was a poor result, but it was a really tight contest. Both sides had their chances, could have gone either way, but in the end, they will be disappointed. But it just seems in this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, he was a major reason why they won today. He was so reliable and he inspires those around him. And they kick off here. 